e-payment and treasury single account by the federal government is one of the best ways to capture revenue leakage in Nigeria. The National Finals and Awards Ceremony of the Students' Inter-Basic School Debate Championship, the 61st in its series, has ended with Kwara State emerging winner after slugging it out with Katsina State, while Imo and Lagos States competed for the third and fourth positions. The first runner-up spoke for and against introduction of single treasury account, while the second runner-up spoke for and against sporting activities for girls at the early stage of their education. Very really. The major objective of creating every single account and new payment is to block all revenue leakages in Nigeria. But there is still one aspect that is not understood. That block of a way, we only create other possible ways. The reason why we believe that introduction of e payment and treasury settlement account by the federal government is one of the best ways to capture revenue leakage in Nigeria is that e payment and TSA is a primary design to bring all government funds and bank accounts within the effective control and Operational view of the treasury. Research has also shown that 82 percent of women in executive level jobs who participate in sports organize sports activities, take gain leadership qualities like teamwork, discipline, and even perseverance. Fear is another reason girls should not be encouraged to participate in sports and activities. Activities. The fear of being discriminated based on their appearance, based on why they decided to participate in the first place, and based on why they decided to spend more time on themselves than on their families. More so, girls should not be encouraged to participate in sports and activities at basic education level in Nigeria because they experience social stigmatization and discrimination. Represented by the Commissioner for Education, Mrs. Folashade Adifisayo, the Governor of Lagos State, Governor Babajidi Sanwolu, informed the gathering of the 1,449 infrastructural projects already commissioned in 1,036 schools in Lagos State. The 96,334 dual composite units of furniture supplied to primary and secondary schools across the state and many more. It reassured of a lot more rehabilitation and the Weeping underway. I am particularly proud of the performances of Lagos State students in various debates and quiz competitions they have participated in at the state, national, and international levels. Their performances are an indicator of the commitment of our administration to ensuring that qualitative education with appropriate infrastructure are provided to all learners and the teaching staff across the state through effective and efficient management of resources. Our administration has delivered over 1,449 school infrastructure projects. This championship will help us in the selection of teams that will participate in the international debate competition coming up next year, just like we did in the past year. When we attended the international debate championships in Qatar, Scotland, South Korea, South Africa, Turkey, Singapore, Indonesia, Thailand, India, and some other countries we attended. The concept of this program will go a long way in providing our amiable leaders of tomorrow greater opportunities for acting, arguing constructively, writing, traveling around the nation, as well as becoming a reading and research culture for Nigeria's children. This event is to showcase the strength of our students, of our greater tomorrow. They indeed told us that they are greater tomorrow and let us applaud these children. When you think of today's event, you continue to have a great memory of Lagos being the center of excellence. The Lagos team got the award of best speaker and the overall third position. Like as my first time competing against other states, I really tried. But I would like to give all the glory and honor to my teammates because they're the ones that encouraged me to do it. I would advise them that no matter how many times they feel, they should never give up. I sat down and think I must commit my time and my energy to this thing. And I feel like, how would it be if I win? All well, thanks to Almighty Allah and that of my teachers and my parents. He kept on encouraging me 
to not relent but keep on striving. A program like this is not just about winning or losing, but also about experience to face the whole world at last. So I hope all other students will indeed try to see that they have had a chance to participate in the bid competition like this. I want to say that we have invested tremendous effort into the training of our children. Hard work pays and that is why we are here. It is hard work that has brought us to this level and I advise teachers to keep up the work. When we got there, we discovered that things are the same the way people are doing it. So we, we strategize on our styles and techniques. I advise other teachers to be determined and focus because they never know what their skills, aims we take them to in life. The event put together by President Schools Debate Nigeria is in collaboration with the Universal Basic Education Commission.